You think he'll wake up? Yes! He did! <laughs> oh, crud! Hide! Put your head down, boy! Hey, what's going on, guys and gals? Paulie Jr. here. It's March 15th, 2018 at the time of this recording. And we are going to play Ghost of a Tale that I found on Steam just a few days ago. It came out and I uh, happened to notice it on the global top sellers list and I was intrigued by the look. So I went to the Steam store page and I read one review, the, one of the very top reviews in fact, and it said, This game is like Thief, except that you play a minstrel mouse, a bard. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Thief is one of my favorite games of all time, easily in my top five PC games of all time. And I've been playing PC games for, well, not all time, but a long time. It is a complete game. It's not early access. I will, of course, put a link down below in the description. So if you do like what you see here and you want to check it out for yourself, feel free. It's $24.99, I believe it is for Windows only. And it's a single player action RPG. Again, much like the game Thief, the original Thief, that is, not the newest one, the latest one that was all like console y. Let's jump in, let's start a new game and have some fun. Ready? Three, two, one, go. In the beginning was the green flame, a force without conscience consuming all in its path. The creatures of the world fought back, but one by one they fell, only to rise again as puppets of the Emerald Fire. It was the rats alone who stood and fought, until at last, at Periclave, the green flame was extinguished. Poof. Mera. Mera, where are you? And so it begins. And there we are. Isn't he adorable? Aren't we adorable? We're so cute. All right. Anyway, let's get down to brass tacks. We're in a prison cell here, and we have to escape. Let's pick up this red rose. New quest. Flowers from Mera. You stood before the Baron, your wife Mera, at your side. He bid you play the poison cup, and you knew then this was not for his amusement, but a test. And so play you did. But from Mera, there was only silence and a look of such defiance. He moved to strike her, the Baron, and you cried out in winter her, and then darkness. How many days have passed since then? In your heart you know she's still alive and that you'll one day find her. Until then, all you have are these flowers, your memories of her, and a question. Why? Mera is our wife, apparently. Now this is as far as I've got. This is all I've done. I got here, and then I went to options, and I set my audio levels and all that jazz in my first attempt at this game, a first loading of this game, and that was it. So the rest is brand spanking new to me. <laughs> so what do we do? Oh, we got mushrooms. How do I pick them up? Left click. Your health is low. Press tab to access your inventory and eat the shrooms. Really? Here you can also find information about quests and lore. Okay. Let us eat the shrooms. That's a candlestick. Shouldn't eat that. We have an apple here, too. Sour apple. We'll eat that down. And there we go. It looks like that's our health bar. And we'll eat the shrooms as well. All right. We're almost full health. So it looks like we have some clothes here and some books. A costume book. Tells us about our guild outfit. <laughs> a hood and a rope belt. Rather Spartan, but that's how we like to roll. As a mouse, we have a song book here as well. Uh, looks like we have many, many songs, and I will not be singing those, of course. And that's the note we just found on the bed. Miscellaneous, we have a loot. A figurine of our infant son, Bryn. Oh, right click to inspect. Bryn's lutka is stained black with ash. Oh my gosh, we have a child. This is horrible. All right, well, we got to find the roses. I guess that's the first quest. So here we go. Flowers for Mera. Collect 17 roses in honor of Mera. No, no. She's still alive. I know she is. She's not dead. I know it. Basin. So left click to pick stuff up and touch stuff. And nothing inside. So yeah, very easy. And the right click is stealth. Oh, that's cool. Apple core here on the ground. Can we eat an apple core? 
Yep. <laughs> We're a mouse. We can hit anything practically. <laughs> All right. Apparently, we have to look in every nook and cranny. This is great here. It's cemented to the stone floor and cannot be opened. Interesting. What else we got? Something here. Bread. Oh. Oh, there's a mysterious message down there under the bread. New quest jailbreak. Find me. Cover your tracks and move unseen. Signed by S. Period. S. Period. And there's a key. <laughs> Whoa. How convenient. I guess that's our cell key to get out of here is my guess. Oh, shrooms growing right here on the wall. Nothing there. Fantastic. Can I jump? Oh, yeah. We can climb. Oh, yeah. Oh, but I got a rose. There's a rose out there. Nice. All right. I'll tell you what I like about this so far is that all the things you can pick up and play with and interact with don't sparkle. Which is kind of annoying. Maybe there's an option for that somewhere under here. Nope, doesn't look like it. And that's fine by me because I, I don't like that. And uh, some of the newer Thief games had that sparkly effect. It's kind of annoying. Oh, here we go. We used the cell. Key door. To open the cell key door. <laughs> Quest updated jailbreak. We have escaped our cell. Woohoo. All right. Oh, a chest. Sack cloth hood. A couple of candles. Oh, we're getting experience too, apparently. Fire steel. Yeah, because it is an RPG. And we have statistics down here. Stamina recovery, sprint speed, etc. Resistances and so forth. Now, let's eat. We don't need to eat right now. Let's not do that. What do we get here? We got some candles and a fire steel. Flint and fire steel to start fires. Um, let's go see what this says over here. Cell manifest. Name, Tylo. Profession, minstrel. Offenses, acts of sedition. Nonsense! I never seditiated or anything like that. Why would I do such a thing? That's us. And Tylo. I'm gonna go with Tylo instead of Tilo. Uh-oh. You have attracted a guard's attention. Quick, go to the chest and hold right mouse, left mouse to hide. Don't forget, you can hide in many places. So we can hide in, like, buckets and cabinets and barrels and then apparently something else. All right, well, let's do it. Hold on. What was it? Right and then left. Oh! Whoo! Just in time. Oh, it's a rat. It's a dirty rat. It looks like we can save here, too. Nobody here but us Mises. <laughs> he doesn't notice the open door, huh? <laughs> uh, it's a typical rat. Let's save it with an F5, and there we go. Now, get me out. Let's get out of there. Man, that's one dumb rat. You can run really fast on all fours. Hold left shift to sprint. Oh, cool. Wait, I hear something. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, bug, yellow bug. Ooh, that's good eating. Can we eat the yellow bug? Yep. It's under food, but we don't need to eat them right now. And I'm hungry. <laughs> we'll just stock up on all this stuff. Where'd that guard go? Oh, he's asleep. Look at that fool. Oh, yeah. All right, let's not go that way just yet. Let's go down here first. Oh, we have a, um, a prison mate. Oh, hey! Hi oh, it's a frog! Hey, buddy! How we doing? Hanging in there? <laughs> Get it? Hanging in there. I'm not just a minstrel, but I'm a comedian, too. We're here all week. Stick around. Grain. Got some grain. Empty chest, but I can hide in there, right? Whoop! I love that. That is so cool. So I think that's the only place you can um, save is when you're hiding, maybe. All right, let's go check on our friend over here. Grain. Grab all the food. It's kind of dark. Can we, uh... Oh, the scroll wheel thingy. Scroll wheel works. Let's go um, say hi to our friend. Can we get in there? Oh, I gotta put the candle down. Hold on. Put the candle away. Put it away. How do you... You just put a lit candle in your purse. Pouch thing. That's bad. Uh, I can't get in there. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. Never mind. <laughs> There's a lever. Oh, look at that lever. That's what that thing does. Yep. That's what it does. Oh, hi. Right. Hi. How are you doing? I'm Tylo. You're an old pirate frog, aren't you? Ferris balls. What do you think you're doing, Mousy? Barging into my cell un uninvited. Do you know who I am? Read footnote. Ferrets are renowned for their wedding festivities, which involve magnificent balls, often danced at a breakneck pace. <laughs> Little innuendo there. Okay, continue, old pirate frog. Huh? I said continue. Because I have no idea. Wait, you don't even know your own name? No. Wait. 
Carold Red Whiskers, that's it. That's a fine name. Carold Red Whiskers, at least I was. Navigator of the Lake Witch under Captain Otto Powder Keg. Let's read the footnote. So this gives you a little extra information, I guess, a little background info. That's kind of cool. Captain Otto Powder Keg was a stocky barrel of a rat with a short fuse. Captain Otto Powder Keg was captain of the Lake Witch, a galleon that for more than a dozen years terrorized merchant ships that ferry goods between the five great ports of Lake Vela. All right, I don't know if I'm going to read all those, but I'll certainly bring them up. You guys can read them, and then I'll close them. Continue, Carol. So, you've come to rob me, have ye? You little scrunt. What the? A word too rude to define? <laughs> I'm sorry? Aye, a mouse is always sorry for something. Every voyage I took with a mouse on board ended in tragedy, and there was always a mouse on board. Now, what is it you want, Mousy? Uh, let's see. Tell me, was it you that helped me escape my cell? What do these chains tell you, Mousy? Does it look like I can help you escape? Hmm, I suppose not. Aye, and I wouldn't if I could. Why not? Har! <laughs> Please, I need your help. Is that right? And what's in it for me? Perhaps I can try to find the key to your chains and set you free. Free? Why would I want to be free? Being free is what got me put in here in the first place. Well, that and the piracy thing. No, I've got everything I need right here. Damp air, all the flies I can eat, and my own stool. You. But there is something. Down the corridor, the sleeping guard. I need ye to strangle him. Wait, what? Because he called me a pirate. But aren't you a pirate? Aye, and proud of it. But it was the way he said it, like being a pirate's a crime. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm gonna just go with unforgivable. <laughs> so you'll do it then. Uh, I mean, uh, I, I could try. Arr, arr, come on, laddie, I'm pulling your leg. I'd never ask you to do something like that. I'll do it myself when the time's right. Why don't you just steal a bottle of his rotten gut for me then and see, and I'll see if I can't help. If, I'll see if I can't help. Right. Rot gut. That's booze. An alcohol made from putrescent oleander wood. Of course it is. All right. Okay. Yeah. I guess we're done here. Oh, it saved automatically. Nice. All right. I'll go do that. I'll get the rot gut. And then you can strangle the fool. And let's, I'm gonna, you're not going to eat those, are you? It's mushrooms? Thanks. And how about this thing here? What is that? Ooh. Ew. What is this, froggy? Gross. Banner. You need the candlestick for that. Oh, I can burn the banner? Ooh, 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 that could be a good distraction, couldn't it? I bet so. It's down here. Uh, candle, please. It's kind of scary and dark. Candle. Candle it up. Wow. Wow, what's the door? It's locked. It's the sewer. We need the sewer key to go down in the sewer. Of course we do. All right, I think we should put the candle away. Oh, wait, a stick. A sturdy branch, well-balanced for throwing. Perfect! Breaks with a sharp crack. Can be used to create a distraction or just lodge an item from its perch. F to throw and then cycle through the tools. Yeah! Yeah, all right. We're going to uh, put this thing away first, dude. Um, get the stick. Tylo, put that lit candle in your pouch. Let's go uh, steal some rot gut. I think I'm going to save it here. Whee! All right, out we go. Stick in hand. Let's go see what we can do with a stick. Now let's get down in stealth mode. Oh, look at that bug! Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, don't get distracted, Tylo. Loves them bugs. with there's another one. Hold on. Grab him. No, that's a basin. <laughs> there we go. That was a different colored bug, wasn't it? We have a yellow bug and a red bug. And I'm, I'm, I'm assuming they're all edible. Known as the Reddens. <laughs> this must be a yeller. It is! It's a yeller! Fantastic. And a bunch of grain. Uh, ooh, spider web. I'm getting distracted again, aren't I? Alright, let's go get that rat gut. Hold on a sec. What is this? It's a door. It's locked. I need the jail master key. I do not have this. What is that? Nothing. Alright. I think it's time. I think I'm stalling. Can we hide in the basin? Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Look at Put your face down in there, you goof! You're gonna get spotted. Oh, that's adorable. This game is amazing. I love it. All right, there's a door here. We can slam if we need to. Try sneaking. Yeah, I know. Uh, oh wait, wait. Grab that bug. Grab that bug. 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 Well, that was a different kind of bug. And an apple. All right, let's get this guard. I think we can distract him, right? 
Ooh, what's down there? Bug! Uh, hold on. Let's just do the rod gut thing. Now, he's sleeping. And I see a bunch of bottles. Down by his feet. What happens here? Look how close we can get. That's amazing. All right, I'm going to throw the stick. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, the little diamond filled up. You see that? Maybe when I'm not hiding and I'm moving, the diamond fills up. Oh, I can stand here and chuck a stick. Oh, <laughs> I tried to chuck it with the mouse. It doesn't work that way. I have to press a button, right? Oh, gosh. Are you ready? Let's throw it. Can I throw it while stealthed? Yeah. Oh. He's going to check it out. It's a stick. I don't think that... I didn't throw far enough. <laughs> Drat. He's still looking, though. No. I didn't throw far enough. Dang it. Go to sleep. Go to... Oh, here comes the rot gut. It's rolling right over. Is that the rot gut? Oh, I see the diamond fills. The more noise you make, but you can stop. And it, uh, it, it goes back down again. Good. Grab a bottle. An empty wine bottle, hefty enough to knock out any guard without a helmet. If thrown with precision, can be used to create a distraction or dislodge an item. That is really cool. You can throw stuff around and dislodge stuff and break stuff. And Oh, there's a target right on his head, and he doesn't have a helmet. Here. Bonk. Oh, shoot. It didn't work. I missed. Oh, here we go. Tread lightly and try not to wake the guard. You're only heard. Move slowly. You're being seen. Uh, looks kind of like the same to me. Oh, it has like a white border being seen. All right, well now we've been spotted. We got a book. We got a book. Hey, ow! Oh, you? He throw something at me? Can we hide now that he's already spotted us? I wonder. Shh! Oh, he's so dumb. Dumbest guard ever. Good thing. Ugh. All right, let's save it. Let's try that again. I want to knock this fool out. Okay. Let's try this again. I'm going to grab this bottle right here. And I'm going to toss it at his head. Now, how did I miss last time? Bonk! Oh, <laughs> he got him that time! Oh, but he's going to wake up eventually. Oh, there's a key! I have acquired the screaming door key and a hanky! Grab his hanky. Oh, there's the rot gut. Rot gut, we got it. Return to Carol. I'm not ready to return to Carol. Yeah, who's the boss now, huh, fool? Yeah, that's right. Can I sit? I can't sit, but I can jump. <laughs> All right, grab that bottle, too, because we can use it to knock him out later. And I can set his banner on fire. Should we do that? We'll do that when he's awake. Let's go. Let's sprint. It doesn't seem like you can sprint for very long. No. Oh, I see the health goes down. Ooh, yeah, that's weird. So health and stamina are together in one bar. Hey, I got your rot gut, Carol. Hold on. Let me put the bottle away. I don't slam him in the head with it. Green bug. Ooh, get the bug. Get the bug. Carol? Pusillanimous. Huh? What does it mean, this word? Uh, it means to be covered in pustules? Her hands caressed his handsome yet pusillanimous face. Exactly. Hmm. Maybe there's hope for me yet. Now, what is it you want, Mousy? Here, the bottle you wanted. It's his last one. Good! Now pop the bottle's neck. Twixt my lips. Next to your lips. Right. Oh! I did it! Sorry. With a deft flick of his head, the frog sends the bottle spinning across his cell. It shatters into pieces against the wall. Every time that grunt gets sauced, I have to put up with his dang snoring. Two words. Yes, that's the scrunt word. Okay. <laughs> so the footnote apparently is associated with the yellow word in the text. Continue. Well, no more. I've done what you asked. Now will you help me? I'll answer a few of your questions. What is it you want? I'm looking for someone. Mara, my wife. Is she a mouse? Well, of course she's a mouse. Wearing a hood. Ha! then who can say? It's not easy to tell you my support with your ears and your tails and your silly hats. What? All right, I'm going to let you guys read that. There you go. And it seems to me like maybe we can wear different outfits as disguises or something. All right. I'm not going to go there with this guy about the hats. Just Have you seen her or not? Brought in alone, you were, like I said. That's your first question. Asked and answered. Uh, all right, so he hasn't seen Mara. What dungeon is this? 
You're in Dwindling Heights Keep on the shore of Lake Vale. Alright, well, let's find out about Dwindling Heights Keep. Seems like the ferrets used to maraud here, but now they're gone, and we just have to worry about acidic waters of the lake. That doesn't sound good. Alright, continue. How long have I been here? Let's see. Must have been more than ten days now since they brought you in. Dead to the world you were. You got one question left, Mousy. Best make it count. Do you speak mouse? Only the curse words. <laughs> right then. <laughs> That's your lot. Are we all square? That's all? You've told me next to nothing, dude. Ugly little. <sighs> Tell you what. Take a look behind me in me chamber pot. There might be a couple of florins in it for you. Florin, F, is the official currency of the five rat provinces. Its coinage is minted in 1F, 5F, and 10F denominations from a naturally occurring alloy of silver, gold, and copper found only in the Sarastra mo mo Mountains and probably the mines. Yada, 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 yada. And I will read that later. I don't think it's that important. Uh, why would there be florins in your chamber pot? Why? I'm not going to hold them in forever, am I? Wait, what? Captives brought to Dwindling Heights will often swallow their valuables in order that they may not be they not be confiscated by the guards. Too much information. TMI there, Carold. It's worth a few forens to be rid of ye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going then. Did he say... He said behind me in my chamber pot, right? Oh, they put it right behind you. I get it. That makes sense. Florins. Ew. A little bit sticky and wet and I don't even want to know. Grab those mushrooms. Although, maybe I don't want to eat these mushrooms. <laughs> Alright, Carol. Nice to meet you. Good luck. Hang in there, pal. Uh, I'm going to close the door, okay? There we go. Give him some privacy. And I'm just so tempted to light this thing on fire. But it's probably going to bring the guard over here, right? Do I have it? Oh, I need a candlestick for that. Right. That's what it says. Poof. Burn it. <laughs> Alright, put that thing away. Quick. Here he comes. Nope. Guard's not coming. Guard's not coming at all. He doesn't care about the fire. Uh. Oh, wait, you burn it because there might be stuff behind there. Florins! Holy smokes, grab them. Got them. Seven floors behind the banner. <laughs> awesome. All right, now, let's save it here right quick. And then we're going to escape this place. Oop. I just want to knock them out because that is way fun. Wham! Ha <laughs> ha! Did it again, you fool. Now we can run. And that looks like a red bug. And a bucket. Oh, I got the bucket. Alright, I don't want the bucket right now. And can I open this door? Jail Master Key. No. Now we got something from him, right? Check the base and nothing in there. Oh, an extra candle. It's always nice. Is there a rose up here like last time? No. There's a door. Woo! Oh, green bug. Get him. We're going down. Hold on. Uh-oh. I think the guard's awake. Close the door. Oh, mushrooms. There's just a ton of food around. That's good, because that's how you heal, right? There's a door. We need the flooded cell key. Holy cow, how many keys and doors are there? <laughs> we have one key so far, right? What was that key that we have? Screaming door key and then our own cell key. So, yeah, that does not help us. The guard doesn't have the keys we're looking for, so my guess is we have to sneak past him now. I wonder if we should burn his banner and see if there's anything behind there. Let's do it. You think he'll wake up? Yes! He did! <laughs> oh, crud! Hide! Put your head down, boy! Oh, no! Uh, question? I, dude, your head's sticking out of the... Okay, that was close. That was real close. Let's not burn things in front of guards, huh, little buddy? I think we I think we need to sneak past him. Go this way. Easy does it. Easy does it. We're good. Doesn't look like there's anything behind that particular banner. Ooh, bug, get him! Yellow bug, it's a yeller! I love the yellers. They're my favorite. We burn this. It's gonna wake that dude up. I don't think there's anything behind it, so let's not. Screaming door. We got it. Woohoo! Why do they call it a screaming door? I'm gonna close it behind me. It's 
Probably gonna be more guards around. Oh, yeller. Another yeller. Let's get in this chest and save it here. All right. We're getting pretty close to the end of this episode, I think. Been playing now for about... Oh, boy. It's a rat. About a half an hour now, so... I think we're just gonna climb into this chest. Hide. Keep it down. Keep it down. And we'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day. Bye-bye.